In the southern kingdom, near the edge of the vast Nairolian forest, lived a kind-hearted king and a just queen. Their names were King Eric and Queen Alara. Eric was known for his wisdom, Alara, for her empathy and fairness. Together, they formed a harmonious bond that radiated throughout the land. But their journey to happily ever after was far from simple. The southern kingdom had not always been a place of peace and prosperity. When Eric first ascended to the throne, the realm was plagued by corruption and fear, thanks to the cruel and greedy rulers who preceded him. His first act as king was to seek counsel with Alara, a revered judge known for her unswerving sense of justice and keen intellect. Their mutual respect quickly blossomed into love, and within a year, Alara became queen. Their reign was marked by the sweeping reforms they implemented. They started by rooting out corruption, ousting dishonest officials, and replacing them with individuals of integrity. Despite the resistance they faced, their resolve never wavered. Eric and Alara spent countless hours visiting towns and villages, listening to their people's grievances and crafting laws that aligned with the needs of the common folk. One of their most significant achievements was the establishment of the Council of Voices, a council where representatives from every corner of the kingdom could voice their concerns and influence the decisions made at court. This inclusivity fostered a sense of unity and trust between the monarchy and the people. But their path wasn't without danger. A powerful warlord from the neighboring northern kingdom coveted their lands and incited fear with rumors of an impending invasion. Unwilling to plunge their kingdom into the horrors of war, Eric and Alara sought a diplomatic resolution. Their efforts culminated in the Treaty of Ellesmere, a pact of peace that not only averted the war but also initiated a period of prosperous trade and cultural exchange between the kingdoms. As years passed, the southern kingdom flourished under their wise and compassionate rule. Gardens bloomed, markets thrived, and the people rejoiced in the safety and opportunity that enveloped their lives. Eric and Alara's children grew up learning the values of kindness and fairness, ready to continue the legacy their parents had built. In the twilight years of their reign, King Eric and Queen Alara often took walks through the Nairolian forest, reflecting on the journey that had brought them from the brink of turmoil to a legacy of peace and justice.